Hello, third grade. Today, we're going to be learning how to use our place value disk to subtract. Before we do an equation, I want to go over some subtraction vocabulary with you. Here I have an equation 8 minus 3 equals 5. Whenever we are subtracting, we always have the biggest number first. And that number is called the menu end, menu end. Then we are subtracting the subtrahend. These are kind of big words, subtrahend. And the answer to a subtraction problem is called the difference. That's the most important thing that you need to know is the difference. So we're ready to look at a problem now. And I have my place value chart. And today we're going to be subtracting 351 minus 236. So step one, I am going to build my menu end, the first number. You notice it's larger. So I'm going to build 300. I'm going to have five tens, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, and one, one. So now we're ready to subtract. So I'm going to start in the ones place. I'm going to look at my um, number, 236, and the ones place has a six. So I'm going to come to my ones place and I'm going to subtract six. But you notice I have a problem. I can't take away six because I've only got one. So that is telling me I am going to have to trade. I'm going to have to regroup. That means I'm going to have to go next door to the tens place and I'm going to have to borrow a 10. I can't borrow just six ones. I have to take the whole 10. So I'm going to move my 10 over here and I'm going to trade it for 10 ones. So I'm going to take out that 10. I'm going to put in 10 ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. excuse me, nine, 10. So now let's count how many ones we have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. I have plenty of ones now and I can take away six. So here they go. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have five ones left over. So five goes in the ones place. Now I'm going to look at the tens place. The tens, I'm going to subtract three tens. Well, fortunately, I have three tens that I can take away. So goodbye tens. Now I have one ten left. So I'm going to put that in my tens place. And next I move on to my hundreds place and I have two hundreds that I need to take away. So goodbye hundreds, one, two. I record my, in my place, my hundreds place. And so the difference of 351 minus 236, this is called the difference, is 115. That's how you subtract using tens disk or place value disk when you have to regroup. Now, question I have is, do you always have to regroup? And the answer is no. Sometimes regrouping isn't required and that's okay too. All right, have a great day.